to Senior Planet. Uh, I see a lot of new faces, some familiar faces. Thank you for making it out tonight to today's very special event for this live um, I don't know if all of you know about OATS and Senior Planet, but OATS is Older Adults Technology Services, um, and Senior Planet is our flagship program. Um, we have one here in New York City that you're all in right now. And we have another one up in Plattsburgh, New York, um, soon to be Denver, Colorado, as well. Um, what we do is we teach technology to older adults. We harness the power of technology to change the way we age. So we do have classes that operate out of this center, as well as the other five boroughs of New York City and other geographies as well, like Denver, Colorado, San Antonio, Texas, and now Palo Alto, California. Our classes go for 10 weeks long, uh, but we also have things other outside of our classes. Uh, we have one-time lectures and workshops where we teach technology to older adults in five different content areas. We teach in creative expression, uh, lifelong learning, um, health and wellness, social engagement, civic engagement, and financial security. Um, and we also have special events like this, so I hope you uh, tune in and subscribe to our YouTube channel so you can see a lot more events that we have like this. Um, I can go on talking about Oats and Senior Planet the entire night, but I won't. I want to introduce a very special guest, longtime member, Calvin Alexander Ramsey. It's also his birthday today. So Thank you. 
Oh, 
And so I cannot thank Kao enough for shooting asking me to do this in that job. Thank you. Thank you. This next song is very special to me because. Toward a clothing door, I don't 
have I have I do this in my home here in San Diego, Jazz Barbecue. It's called Jerome Carla J. It's kind of Carla out too. It's early San Diego. So we might get back to Bobby Shorty and Carla out because that was such a special time. Um, but first, can I have some punching man? So a lot of a lot of uh, a lot of gentlemen were, were in a, a, a country club, and so they were playing squash or rack ball, whatever gentlemen play country clubs. I have no idea what they been a member. So. so all the guys were getting dressed after working, out. and if there was a phone. They're sitting on the bench in the room of the change. And so the phone rang, and the gentleman was sitting and just hit the button on the speakerphone. And he said, hello. And the voice that I did, he said, hello. Uh, the voice said, you know, I was in the Hamptons recently. And the house that we had looked at, the house that we looked at, uh, was on sale for only 14 million. And you know, it's such a steal, and I really would love to have it home. So the, the boy said, Nick, if you want, if you want the home, you get the get it sold. So I was told on, thank you so much. She said, and by the way, I was driving down the avenue and the brooch that I wanted at Tiffany's, it was a beautiful diamond number of brooch. And she said, I really would love to have it. She said, Dog, if you, if you really want the brooch, then get the brooch. And she said, Oh, and by the way, the Mercedes that I had my eye on for such a long time. It's been after a long time. Blue. Blue. Roar. So she said, Dog, it's only, it's only $180,000. She said, Dog, if you want it, then please. please. Yeah. And Stokey, I'll see you in the hall, Stokey, good night. And so the whole room was listening to this. So after he got up, he picked up the phone and said, Does anyone know whose phone this is? <laughs> and let's put all your money. Oh, I love this song. I hope you do. That do. I haven't read the book. Many years ago. We don't know that. I took a trip on the train and I thought of my ear. I passed a shadow in my hand and I thought of my ear. There were two or three cars parked under the stars for a happy stream.
Thank <laughs> you.